what's going on? Not used to the camera being this damn close to my face. Last episode, Chloe got in a car accident. I just hope she isn't dead. Let's watch this damn episode. Yo, you see that toy right there, bro? I used to have one of those. Oh, is this when Chloe gets hit? I don't know why I just said that. Of course this is when Chloe gets hit. I have a tendency to ask dumbass questions. Oh my god. What? What? It was a Lucifer. It was a freak accident. A dog ran into the middle of the road. You had nothing to do with it. She still does not believe Lucifer. So in her case, Lucifer just sounds crazy as hell. Mace and I have become friends. Sort of. Mace and Chloe oh, really? is friends. The character a... development. Can you read this to me, Mommy? Uh, no, Trixie! Lucky. I just got it. your bedtime story. I'll read that to you tonight. No, read it to me now. Damn. The cops get hurt all the time. I don't want you to get hurt. Oh, Maybe. Trixie. Uh, yep, his name Swiss is... Where's the cabbage? How do you know that? How do I know that? <laughs> Star of the Body Bags movies. Icon in the action genre. Body, body Bags 4. <laughs> Detective, it's a chance to escape your reality for a moment. Some people need that. When is Decker going to make more movies? We need to sit down and watch a Decker film. Looks like he was living here. Body Bag 6. <laughs> What's the cause of death? Dude was hit with a nunchuck statue. First God for me. damn. The goal I know who the killer must be. The dreaded Ninja Izaki from Body Bag 6, Tokyo Fire. <laughs> Body Bag Who else will get the jump on Wesley Cabot? <laughs> we need to be discreet about it, because the detective hates it when I mix business with pleasure. Uh, bed in there looks a little skanky, but I'm up for it if you are. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Okay. Uh -oh. Yeah. Okay. I mean, no. Huh? You're the son of God. Exactly, yes. I get it. I mean, Stanislavski would be very proud of you. Okay, I'm, I am not a method actor. So method of you saying, <laughs> damn. You oh. Lord have mercy. Uriel! Never mind. I what? thought it was you. What? Well, welcome to it. Clearly, I got the fashion sense in the family. Do you say brother? The trench coat, being what the sort of heck? Pedophile. What do you want, Uriel? I came to tell you that you have 24 Uriel? hours. Uriel? Either return here with mom, or I'll finish what I started with your detective. Oh, he's the one that's Cut. doing that? Bring mom to me, or I'll take back what dad gave you. Damn, bro! Yo, I didn't know he had more brothers. How many brothers this dude got? He's after Chloe or that classy bitch you call mom. Damn. You Let us know how you really feel, Maze. Brother, that Uriel can play with patterns, a butterfly flap its wings, and a housewife gets chlamydia. Jesus. Or Chloe. Because Uriel won't be a problem. We have a nuclear weapon. Who? You. Miss. We all know he won't listen to me, but he will if it's someone from the home team. So you will go and convince him that he needs to go back. I don't know how that's gonna work out though. His powers, bro. I mean, I don't know how he's gonna convince him. Piers, I was correct this morning. You are being targeted by cosmic forces. Damn, this episode is final destination. I'm gonna need you to be unpredictable. <laughs> Do the opposite. Too bad. I was totally gonna have sex with you today. Ooh. That was a good one. Thinking. Fine. I mean, I even skipped out on some of our wedding planning to see Body Bag Six. Remember? That was the big <laughs> emergency. It was totally worth it. We and need you, to watch Body Bag Six now. Bad. I can't believe Wesley's Mom. really gone. I thought that was Mom. When was the last day for Wesley Stojo this morning? Welcome to Devil Time. Uh oh. What are you doing? Trying out my new catchphrase. <laughs> Welcome to Devil Time. Yo, this episode is hilarious, bro. What is instructor? And how does the weaponizer feel about all this? Character played by Kimo Van Chloe, get it together, girl. Well, and you. Without Body Bags 4, you were nothing, man. How does Body Bags 4 figure in? Franchise, the weaponizer. Personal fave, weaponizer 4, the last. The weaponizer 4. <laughs> Again, I apologize that the children were late for school. And yes, I'm Mom is doing well. <sighs> That's a damn shame. You. Are here to take me back to hell? No, Mom, I'm not. Well, he's gonna do that if he wanted to. Perhaps he must be someone really evil for the weaponizer to get involved. Just some guy in trouble with the mob. So they've got his family and they're forcing him to kill the president. <laughs> oh, he's got a <laughs> oh, hold on. So you, former A-list, B-list actor, now breaking legs for the mob. Just to pay the bills. I'm broke. Oh, Damn. God. Your transfer on the murder weapon. 
Timo Vincent, you're under arrest for the murder of Wesley Cabot. Well, I'd be damned. There's something more to this I case. I thought he was broke. Oh, I paid his bail. Even uh, this Lucifer. Wonderful, pathetic stat, the <laughs> so, for someone with so many hit movies under their belt, why is he so broke? He's out of cars, private islands, Bino Tiger. Oh, this man been balling out of control. Why isn't Dan checking the album? Dan is hilarious, bro. <laughs> Lucy! I mean, not Lucy. Amanda Dale! There might be a better way to handle this without violence. What, like hugging him back to heaven? Like, Mom, <laughs> that's a good one. And, look, just because he told us his plan doesn't mean that's his plan. It's Uriel. Is Amanda Dale doing this because he's like, yo, I ain't got no powers, so I can't do nothing. Brother, you've been here too long. It's changed you. You're you. Amena Deal, firstborn. Yeah. Yikes. Just the sight of you will send quivers down your real spine. Woo! This is tough. Amena Deal can't do shit. All he needs to see is me in all of my glory. Here okay, so the that. glory part. That's what he can't see at the moment. You know that's kind of fading away. Amena Deal. Hey, look at the that's swag. But Yuri, you must go home. Lucifer's still on Earth. Now Mom's here, too. I'm here to help. You really think I need your help? Pathetic small Uriel. Not the eldest son. Oh, not shit. Not the young rebel. Oh, but shit. But an angel buried. And it's not if true. God wants something done, he sends me. Me. Yo, he's killing it right now. I take I back what I said. Planet. And you, little brother, are standing in my way. I'm sorry. I'll return home. Something's bothering me. I knew it. I doesn't usually talk so much. More a man of action. Something's happened to you. Oh my god. This is a smart one right here. Boy, damn. Yeah. Damn, I hate the fact that he's losing his wings, bro. Glory, his power. At the scene, Wesley was going over all of his old body bags for stuff. How rare is it that the fourth movie is that iconic in a franchise? Ah, right, let me just make myself comfy. Because Lucifer is going to be like, yo, I know you didn't get your ass whooped. Damn. I no longer have my powers. Is it because I'm working with you or because of mom? Or am I simply no longer worthy? It's time that I face the truth, brother. Oh my God. I've fallen. My very strength. Big deal. It's probably the best thing that ever happened to you. Hmm. But right now, I'm out there and the clock is up, which means the detective is in grave danger. Lucifer's response. I was not expecting him to respond that way. He actually took the information very well. I like how he responded. Join the club, bro. I've been there. Just because you lost your powers, that don't mean nothing. Damn, this dude's job is just to create havoc. This dude's about to be really creative, man. Ooh, hey, how you doing, girl? Mother! <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. She was just like May's babysit. Mom had that kid in chains, bruh. She don't mess around. Had that kid in chains and had that kid barking. Damn, that's gangster. He did it. He's the one who killed Wesley. No, it was her idea. It was her idea to switch out the nunchuck award, cover it in blood. Gotcha. Like, killed Wesley? Then you tried to frame it for it? Y'all crazy as hell. Kimo, put the gun down, please. Get out of the way. No. Decker? You're up against this was engineered to put you in harm's way. You must believe me. I know exactly what I'm up against. No. Just a man. Lucifer has a point. Who's in a the truth is, I'm terrified. I'm scared of how it can all just end. We can't control what happens to us. Make the right choice, Kimo. It's put down the gun. That was deep. Deep as hell. I see you, girl. No. I just want to give her a I'm, big hug. I'm okay. Hold on. Okay, so Get Hard, that's the Kevin Hart and Will Ferrell movie. I don't know what the hell this is. And this is Focus. This is the movie with Will Smith 
and Margot Robbie. Look at me pointing out the movie billboards. I'm so cool. Yeah. I'm still expecting to see another Supergirl billboard. <laughs> Mom. I'm letting Uriel take me back to hell. When did you Let come to go. this decision? Meaning of loyalty. It's what's best for everyone. Damn. She belongs. Chloe is safe. And I don't have to clean up your mess anymore. Bird, you're serving out your sentence here on Earth. You know that's not what your father wanted. Do I? Human wars have been waged because of it. Hmm. Does that mean I was meant to take you back to hell? Or was he insinuating that hell was getting drafty? Nobody bloody knows because the selfish bastard won't just tell us! No more. You have to side with Lucifer on this one. God is not being direct with what he wants Lucifer to do. It's a lot of deep scenes in this episode, but we gotta stop his ass though. Uriel, whatever his name is, Ukraine. For a brief moment, the pattern faltered. Uh-oh. Surprise, but no. No, here you are. I don't like him. Yes, it's just me now. Big bad Lucifer. I think you're right. I don't know what dad wants, none of us do. Right. Right. I'll buy the first round. But I do know what he needs. Which is? She's been here like, what, three minutes? Now you're already defending her. He'll do the same thing. He'll let his guard down. This is a smart and cookie. And she'll just make sure that doesn't happen. That's Azrael's play. Azrael? Wait, Azrael? I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Who the hell is Azrael? That weapon will wipe her out of existence entirely. No heaven, no hell, just, just gone. Completely insane, brother. I hear a sequence will begin in two days from now. Your cute little human will finally die. Oh my god. Very well. Come on, Lucifer, whoop I his ass. See it coming. Whoop his ass. He ain't see shit coming. I just wasn't sure how. Man, he ain't ready for Lucifer, bruh. Sit your ass down. Tend to them. I needed to study you a bit. Oh. Come on, Lucifer. Oh, this dude can whoop ass. Oh. Oh. Jeez. Who is Azrael, bro? Am I the. Oh, I'm about to cry. That was amazing. I am fanboying out right now. First time fanboying out on this show. Holy mother of God. Get off me! Get off Come on, Maze. Come on. What is that? Come on, girl. Get his ass. But still predictable. How is his ass whooping these people's asses? Come on, whoop his ass! Don't tell me he whooped Maze's ass, bro. You can't stop me, bro. <gasps> Come in. Oh. Oh. Shuck it, duck it, quack, quack. What do you say? Served. This is. Boy! <laughs> Yo, he killed his brother, bro. Yo, and I still got two minutes and 11 seconds left. Oh my God, I can't even process what I just saw. The oh my God. Is over. What have I done? This, this is crazy, bro. <laughs> Look at him, bro, he is hurting. Amazing episode, bro. Lucifer killed his brother. I don't know what happens from here. I really don't.